Hi there! Thanks so much for tuning in for this week's mainstream video video where we are talking all about how to script your video. And we're going to talk about it in three steps. So step one is actually knowing how a video script works. So I use the word script and storyboard kind of interchangeably. If you've watched some of our videos, you'll already know that. For me, a storyboard includes a script. The script is actually the written words or the narrative or the driving story behind what your video is. The storyboard includes the scripts and then also what you're going to have for visuals. So the way we categorize this is by calling it A roll, which is that script or that main narrative, that main message, and then that B roll, which is all the visual things you're going to experience as part of the video. One thing about scripting video is that you don't always have to tell if you can show. So you don't have to go into your college degree and where you went to if you're showing us a picture of, say, your master's degree or the front of your college. You can say, I graduated college, you know, shot of CSU. That's your B-roll. So those two things are important to know as you go through writing your scripts. Now we'll get on to step two. Step two is all about considering your audience. So if you're creating a video for your business, which you likely are, and that's why you're watching this video, you have to think about where your audience is. And that is really all that matters, who your audience is and where they are on their journey. Now, remember that the start of a buyer's journey is that somebody doesn't even know you exist. They know that maybe they have a problem. Maybe they know about the solution, but they don't know that you're it. And that conversation is very different from the conversation that you might be having when the customer is ready to make a decision and they're just overcoming some final objections. So thinking through where is your audience on the buyer's journey is going to help you decide what your script and storyboard looks like. The one thing that I always recommend for any video you're creating is to be able to say in one sentence, at the end of my video, my audience will. My audience will opt into my newsletter list. My audience will download this freebie. My audience will buy now. My audience will set up a meeting with me. Whatever your call to action is or whatever you want your audience to do, it needs to be crystal clear. And then that informs what the rest of your storyboard script looks like. So we're going to talk about how to bring that all together in step three. Step three is about writing out and mapping out your actual video on paper. So thinking about what words you want to use, if you're direct to camera, you can also be interviewed. That's totally acceptable and looks great in a lot of scenarios. Or it can be graphics, like a lot of what you're seeing in this video, where we use text to kind of drive forward the story. Whatever your A roll is, script it out. And whatever your B roll is, script it out and you'll get a final, final product that looks like this. Thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions, we want to hear about them. You can contact us on email or come over to our Facebook page. Thanks for watching.